Greetings, my people, from the Great Start Studio, where we're asking the question, how do you play in 4-4 time? 4-4 time is the most popular meter. It's also called common time, and it's a meter that every drummer needs to master. Today, we'll be answering the question, how do you identify 4-4 time in a song? How do you play in 4-4 time? How does 4-4 time affect the groove of the song? As well as, what's the best method for learning 4-4 time for real-world playing situations? As always, thank you for subscribing and joining me here on the channel. Now let's get right to the content. If you can count to four, you can play and measure in 4-4 time. Four four time is the most common meter, and it includes four quarter notes. One, two, three, four. You can identify a song in four four time by counting one, two, three, four along with the song. If you hear the groove of the song start back over on one, it's probably a four four meter song. Songs in four four time have a very even meter. They swing side to side, one, two, three, four. There are many, many ways of dividing up 4-4 four, four time, even to the point where it's unrecognizable as 4-4 four, four time. In the Great Start series, we build the entire series out of the 32 grooves. These are the 32 subdivisions that make all music work. <music> volume 2 and Volume 3 are the drum set books based in 4-4 time. It's in these volumes that you get a solid foundation in understanding how most major music works. Four-four time can be divided up from quarter notes, eighth notes, sixteenth notes, and triplets, but it's still four-four time. You can even have phrases playing across the bar line while other phrases are playing still within 4-4 four, four time. These are called over the bar phrases. You can play virtually every kind of style in 4-4 four, four time. Most all of the drum covers that I have done are in 4-4 four, four time. Odd meters are any other meter than 4-4 four, four time. 
we should use the same exact application to those meters as we do for 4 4 time to flesh out real great feeling grooves. Hey, once again, thank you for joining me here on my channel as I walk through all of these different types of scenarios that drumming requires. All of this content is to help all of us improve our drumming for real, to have the confidence of knowing what we're actually talking about. This is the number two book of the series out of 10. It, they're all available on Amazon. It'll walk through all the groove types, all the meter types, subdivision types, style types. You want to get in there, get the deep dive, get it into you. Hey, hey, if you made it this far, click a like, make a comment. It really helps me get my work out there. And if you like my content, check out the videos at the end of this. And so from the Great Start Studio, I'm back at it.